presenting a whole new look, a whole a different weapon, and a and a whole new outfit and weapon armor change. I present to you the new armor loadout, the new weapon, and the new attire of buddies and myself. The, the magic gang, the magic trio. Still working on the name. <laughs> hey everyone, my name is Mike Godwin, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Rise. I know that I haven't been uploading a lot of this content recently, and I, I haven't been posting a lot of them. Like, I've only posted like two in the last month. But hey, we're, I'm finally getting back to it, and I'm going to be working all this, a lot harder to get more of these videos up recently. So, yeah, this is the new armor. It's a mixture of Rachna Kadaki's um, leg armor, the greaves, Narcacuga's van braces, the arms, and the waist armor, and Camellios' helmet and like, hat and chest piece. And I put all these together, and I made the name of before I completed this full loadout but I call this loadout the Mike the Purple in reference to the Lord of the Rings character Gandalf the Grey. <laughs> I've also been I've also been using bow this time and I also got my buddies here Palco and Palamute the Community of Summer as well to go along with the magic genie magic kind of theme we got going. And it's also the best armor they got yet. My other buddies are all on a some of them are off on a over here they're they've been sent out on a expedition to the frost islands I don't know what they're called it just says me out scenario so the other two are working so they're all busy and yeah I've been working a lot on bows but now we have another urgent quest for seven star so let's see what we got sorry make sure I'm recording also I have my hair pushed forward I don't know if it looks good what do you guys think Hmm. I think it looks pretty good. We'll go with it this time. Mike, I have I have an urgent quest for you. As we speak, a Kushala de Aura threatens to lay waste the Frost Islands. Oh yeah, I knew Kushala was in this. This is going to be fun. The winds it calls alone could plunge the entire region to sheer oblivion. There's not a soul I would trust to handle a crisis like this more than you. Now then, hop to it to it. Okay. Oh, another thing? Oh, hello there, Mike. I spotted good news for you. The guild was quite impressed by your recent efforts. Oh, thank you. A guild ticket. Guild tickets? Okay. Um, Kushala. Um, I remember Kushala. I'm sorry. Let me, um, adjusting my hair a little bit. That's probably a bit much, but it's fine. Alright. Okay, give me a second. <laughs> back. It only took me like five seconds, but I put my hair back here because as much as it looks pretty good fit forward, but it's kind of itching and kind of gets in the way, and it's annoying to make, get right, like to a, like push hair some here and push hair and not have it like on my ear. And I have it like this, and I like this. It's nice. Nice hair. Yep, all that. Anyway, Kushala de Aura. Um. I remember him from World. I fought him in the World. I just don't remember what his weakness is. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's not gonna be ice. Because his weapons have ice. Even if they're hidden, it's still ice. I got a lot of bow options for it, though. Which is very nice. Okay, I'm recording, thank gosh. I've done, like, a million. Um, I've done, like three full recording attempts already i've done like two, one or two attempts at that intro and uh, and this is like the third or fourth cut maybe i think it's the second i don't know okay he's metallic so i'd assume fire to melt him but he's also he can rust because i heard of rusted kushala from old games so water might work to cause um oxidation Blast, it would eventually become Mewtwo. Genie's Grimoire is just raw damage. Um, that doesn't have Elder Seal, so it wouldn't really be much benefit. Was he Thunder Weak? Uh, let's just bring Fire and see how that turns out. Also, I got Rarity 7 armor now, and the other stuff's Rarity 6. Yeah, I've improved my build a whole lot. Since last time, I'm not lying, like, 
these skills, there's so many good skills on here. Sure, my crit and attack boost, my critical eye and attack boost are not the highest. So how can I help you? But it's, yeah, I'm working on it. Mike, we have an, ur I, I just need more jewels to improve it. Mike, we have an urgent quest for you. Just so you're aware, completing this urgent quest unlocks Hunter Rank 30 for you. Your target is, Kushal, is a Kushala de Aura, an Elder Dragon with metallic scales that can manipulate yes. wind. It will attack you with Cyclones or use them to form defensive barriers. Study its patterns to find an opening. Well then, best of luck. I used- Yeah, I fought a fair amount of Kushala de Auras back in World, so... I don't remember his weakness though, because I didn't hunt him often enough to remember. So I'm gonna assume fire because I got um, fire attack level four to bring it up to 22 instead of 17. Um, Wrath blows too, so I'm assuming this will help. <gasps> oh, cutscene. Dashing. Sorry, I have to check on recording still. A snowy plain, monsters nipping at the heel. Ooh. Out of breath, limbs in pain, doomed to end. No, <laughs> what is that? A malign? No, Malinxes are the darker ones, right? Are they different? Ooh, yes, save the Palico. Oh, no, take him with you, okay. It's Kushala! Oh, I missed Kushala. Kushala is actually a very cool dragon. I love this one. If it, oh my god, that's nice. He doesn't even know what happened. Let's go. Let's go get him. It, it legit looked like it helped out. Like it saved the Palco. It's like, yep, still kill it anyhow. I mean, to be fair, it's an Elder Dragon, and their not in their mere presence causes a big threat to things, to the ecosystem. Let's go get him. I wonder what skills his armor would have this time, because very often. In um, Worlds had a lot of power for longer, but this version gives a lot more critical eye, I think. So this guy should could be very different from his older armor, which I forget what, what it had. I'm assuming Wind Res was one of them. There he is, the metallic Wind Dragon. Get him. Okay, I think I hit no weak point already. Is it his stomach or was it his wings? No, was it his shoulders? Come here. I'm still working on bows as I at right. I was w still working on bows when I record. Sorry, recording. But I've been grinding forever. Just I might as well get the video out. I really want to make it. Okay, yeah, it is like his. Or is it like his abdomen? No, it seems to be his back, or like his shoulders. Um, why was he flashing red? What, uh, why does he have red arky electricity? He seems pretty rusted, he seems very orange. Does he not summon the tornado? Yeah, it seems like his neck and shoulder. There it is! Oh, that looks so good in this one! I'm afraid to get hit. I do not want to know what this guy can do. He looks amazing like always though. Which I really like. Oh. What hit me? Oh wait, um, attack boost, go! Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, <laughs> whoa! That was awesome! I like that attack a lot. Oh my god. <laughs> Just let me summon a legion of tornadoes and launch them at you. See if you can escape the convergence of torrents. So, a torrent. Ow. Oh, so he has dragon element in this version. Okay. I'm not upset about that, but that's actually weird. I didn't think he would. That's the first time I've ever been hit with dragon blight, too. Prevents you from using your weapons. That oh I forgot that's what Dragon Element does. Dragon Blight. Um 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 um. Oh there it is. Uh uh. 
element is like everything as a bow. I I kind of need that. Oh, he's running away. Okay, keep the null bears on standby because those are like everything for me. <laughs> Good, the moment it start, I it hit me with dragon blade. I swear it starts showing zeros. I was like, no, no way, <laughs> please. Elements are everything. I need those. Oh, okay, no, it's not the element that was making me have zeros. It wasn't the blight. It was. It's that it made. Wind aura. Oh, so wind aura is negating my arrows from landing. Where can I hit him? Oh, that's like his ultimate from the old game. Not the old game, um, world. It's just a very powerful beam of, like, very powerful attack. It's just all wind. Okay, was. Was I one shot? I don't think I was. I th and the, the moment I get, no way! C come on, shut up, shut up! I want to see this. I missed it entirely. Ooh, Magnum all amount though. No. Yes. I was about to say no, no, no. Don't, don't wear down. Okay, now you gotta face my Magnamalo. Okay. Oh, it's a double hit. Ooh, that one hit well. Ow. More wins for you. Plus a smash so I can get... Plus I ran... I... Why can't I think of a word? Like... Then I smash you into him, through Stooges style, and then I get to use you like a weapon into Magnamala. <laughs> okay, yeah, I don't think, I think I had less than max health, so. Don't you hit me. I know exactly what that Magnamala wanted. He wanted to kill me. I almost just got hit right in the dome. Oh my gosh, push all it. Watch out. Hold on, I need this stuff. I am risking everything just to pick that up. Okay, so it's like his tail and head are where I can hit him now. Do I have to knock the aura out of him? Like, do I have to top one to knock the aura away? <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. Oh wait, I got big dodges. No. <laughs> that is amazing. Okay, now that's an amazing ultimate. So I thought it was the other one that was his ultimate. No, that was it. Well, I guess they might have like two different versions. Wind beam and then high category tornado. How are tornadoes classified again? Or is it like E's as their category? Like E15 or something like that. I don't know how. I, I forget. I think it is. But. Oh well. Come on. This is actually a cool stinking monster. I, I actually love it. Come on. Arrows of. Arrows of. Oh! Technically, arrows are plenty for you. The moment I activated my attack buff, it adds like what? What is it like? Plus 10 or something like that? No, put put the bow away. Excuse me. I'm just fly up the wall. Ooh, endemic life. I recently started doing, like, just today I started doing the, um, sub, optional sub quest. I don't, like, they give most, it seems like they mostly give armor spears, which is always nice. Back away. Oh, sorry, Anteca. I hope that's your species name. I don't remember what you're called. I, I think it is Antecas. 
Okay, still recording, we're good. Don't you dare get shot at. This ain't. Why'd you make a flash of black? Oh no, it's making tornadoes. I'm gonna just stick near my trees. Trees of safety. Okay. Mm -mm. Why? Why is it black? Why is it black smoke? Why is it black tornadoes? No, -uh, black smoke usually equals very evil and bad. No, dark smoke evil. Its soul is evil. It's like smog, like smog, or like soot in a chimney. Kushala, if it hit a chimney during its flight. I feel like that would be just Kushala if they if it ran into the Celiana in world and just hit one of the um steam engines and it got hit by like one of the pieces of charcoal. Shaw and Justice of Charcoal, that's probably about it. <laughs> mm -mm, good shot at. Uh, most of my attacks are doing nothing. Get your dragon away. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah, it's the head, but it's so... Oh, dear. Please don't hit me. Oh, I barely dodged that. Kushala is so different in this. It, I, it's sometimes hard to tell what it's about to do. The moves are way different, so I don't know kind of what to expect. Back up. Okay, no way it was trying to pull me in with that tornado. Because if so, that is so cool. If that tornado can, like, pull you in, that is so amazing. Nope, nope, get back, get back, stay down there. I said stay down there, get away! <laughs> back, Kushala, go down. Oh, no more wind aura, good. It seems like the moment it adds one... Oh, broke apart. Okay, I just thought of Elder Dragons. Um, before I started working for the Camellio's chest piece, I've well. only killed one Camellio. So I only slayed or like hunted one Camellio's. Oh, I'm freaking camera. So I checked. I killed a total of seven other Camellio's on just because like I had all the parts I need after like the second or third Camellio's. But, I couldn't get the gem because it's like a 3%, so I spent like over a day just grinding Camellios just to get that gem. And it was so worth it because of ballistics and mines I added onto my build. Get your tornadoes away. Okay, it seems very different from World, because Kushala in World, when it makes a tornado, spins itself in the airplane. I feel like it just shoots like a gust of air out of its mouth and it makes a tornado. Also, Kushala having dragon element is cool. It puts more threat onto Kushala, which I do appreciate. I really love Kushala being always such a cool dragon. Get away! You will not best me. Oh no, itchy hair, itchy hair, nope, nope, my hair started itching randomly, no, please. Oh, it doesn't have Windora, and it has Windora. Why does it create like a smog, like a black fog when it, in its tornadoes? Like, that's like, that's just a great tornado, but it's like, it suddenly becomes like a shadowy fog. And I don't get it. Like that, like, you just saw it's, um, the black start forming, like the black shadows start forming around it, like the black smoke. Ooh, can I get two in? Uh, uh, risky, risky. Okay, I can get two in, it's just very, very risky, depending on what it does after it gets up. Because it could've just shot me with a tornado and probably one shot me. Like, is that like, just infused with Dragon Element? Because Dragon Element's like, you know, like a black smoke with, um, red lightning in it, so it could just be infused with Dragon Element. Now I'm curious if Kushala had Dragon Element in the past. Oh no. Okay, I thought I just got hit. No, that's just 
dragon element. That's not dragon, it's just the wind aura pushing me. Nothing to worry about, it's just wind. It's just the wind. No. Oh, T-Rex. Uh, okay, he looks like or like browner, like more, you know, muddy. So I was like, wait, Brute T-Rex, please. <laughs> Why is Brute T-Rex here? Ooh, Kushala powers. Tornado. Oh, okay, it's legit a tornado. Okay, give me T-Rex. I need him to beat you up. Oh, this is so much fun. Bing. Come on. Spin! Do a little spin. Another spin, because I like spin. <laughs> this is fun. Another spin. No. Scream. Okay. I gotta do the mountain punishment or else I don't know what happens if I don't. I'm pretty sure I get kicked off. And stay down. Here comes the pain. Oh. Mm, dear me. T-Rex, please don't come after me. Okay, he doesn't mind. He's like, yeah, we did our thing. You have fun. Bye. I'm glad he did an extra stream, though. That, like, reset the topple time. Oh, no. Oh, no, not this again. 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 Uh-uh. Ooh, T-Rex. I thought it was Kushala material. Eh, either way, it's good to have is another part broken? No, it's just uh winks. I'm going after it. Hold on, glow squids. Hey, wait, are they glow squids? No. Um, what are they called again? Small. No, they're endemic. They're called prism squid or something like that. Lamp squid. Oh, they're gone. Never mind. <laughs> I I just wanted to know what they were called. gonna that's not gonna keep me from getting back to Kushala me and Kushala have some unfinished business recently heard that this skeleton here is a Zora Magdaros not recently like within a few months like a few months ago I think I heard that like yeah this is a Zora Magdaros skull which is so cool because in world it's the Dolomador that makes up the rod and veil where monsters go to die and the frost islands in rise is where monsters come to die and it's a Zora Magdaros skeleton which is such a cool thing. And there's like the, the dark smog again. Like like the black smog. What's it do? I want to know what it does. Nope. Stamina recovery move. Boing! Uh-uh. Good shot at. I'm doing nothing. Absolutely nothing. My shots are obsolete to the wind. But the wind's obsolete to getting stunned by my buddies, I'm pretty sure. That was pretty sure my buddies. Ooh, 29. I don't really use the side shots in the front. I need to start using my arc shots. Hold on. Affinity boost. Go! That's such a neat thing I like about Rise. Because in World, it was, um, you shoot a bag into the sky with your arc shot, and it would just drop a bunch of metal rocks that built stun quickly. Like, not quickly, but it can build stun. Which is by itself super cool to me but i really like the concept of having arc shots with like knockback res affinity boost or healing so you can be a very like supporting type of player as well as doing very good dps while with people or just boosting yourself hold on lamp squids <gasps> yo what it <laughs> what is that <laughs> That was amazing! <laughs> I'm sorry, just getting randomly hit in the face by that thing. I was like, I've never been hit by a, I've never been injured by a turf war in any game, any of World of Rise. When I, like any of my World of Rise experiences, never led me to get hit by the turf war. So that 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 was amazing. I am so happy that happened. That was hilarious too. Amazing turf war. But freaking hilarious no that I just got hit by it. I'm so glad that's a mechanic. Oh, glow squid. Not glow squid, lamp squid. Gosh. They, I guess one of them hit me with an effect and it automatically ramped up my powers. Wait, aren't lamp squids kind of like spirit birds? 
Oh my god, Magda Malo. I love you, buddy, but I don't want to fight. Oh no, the item despawned. Oh well, gotta go. Oh, it didn't, but we gotta go. We gotta go after... Oh, we gotta go to the planet now. Let's see if we can run around and collect it. We sure can. Snoink, yoink, got your soul prisms. See ya. You just rock back to Molo. Go, 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 go. <laughs> hey, Kushala, we're back. What you been up to? It's been a while. That turbo is crazy. <laughs> Oh, I, I can't get over the turf war. That was so darn cool. I just... I just all I saw was the back of Magamalo flying at me, and I didn't even realize I was going to get hurt by him, and all of a sudden, boom, an explosion went off. That was... <laughs> it's, it's so pretty. <laughs> just boom. Is it like picking up dirt? Oh, no. Dodge, dodge. Um, I think they're coming at me. You know what? I'm gonna try to paralyze you with my Rathalos bow. Prowls and coding, go! I'm very bad at aiming, if you can, if you couldn't tell. Well, it's only because his head. I can't paralyze him, but I can most certainly cause a stun. Okay, is he more prone to paralysis? Because I got paralysis plus. Not paralysis, poison plus. Oh, and you're going blind. Good job, Antline. I'm blind as well. Okay, that was a fast tornado. Um, it seems like... Oh, wait, no, that's the I'm blind effect. Not the paralysis is building up effect. That flash means the... Get away. I'm just gonna... Back away. Very quickly. Because I got Vedic Center 3. I am out of there. Okay, let's just power coding. Because I am being horribly irresponsible with my shots. Did you forget I was... That was so darn cool! I am using a max potion. I am surprised I didn't die from that. I fully expected to die. Nope, get away. Get away. Uh, get away. Get away. Okay, if a simple... Compressed, or... Yeah, I don't know if that's compressed or it's typical. If a little air beam can almost one-shot me, I do not... Ooh, distance view. Yeah, he does the spin to make his um, whirlwind. That is cool. Like, it tries to form a tornado, but it actually can't. So it's so cool to see. I'm still here. Let's... Oh, he's going. Okay. That was insane. I, I love... This is awesome. <laughs> Yoink. What? Don't know why I'm adding sound effects. It just sounds cool. I hope I'm making good progress on this guy. Let's see if I can build Mount Meter, because if I can, I want to bring him over to a T-Grex, to the T-Grex again. And use T-Grex as some thing, because I, I know for a fact now, well, I, I'm more, I'm more confident in my idea that when you see a blue flash when you attack and it lands, I'm pretty sure that's building the Wyvern Ride Mount Meter. See those blue ones? When you do like jump, like when you do an attack that when you're airborne or you just jump off something. Back away. I think I'm doing pretty good on my first Rise Kushala. Like my first monster on the Rise Kushala. I'm pretty sure I, I feel like I'm doing pretty good. Oh dear. Hold on. Let's exploit one of my favorite play styles and just close range fight this guy. Actually, it's not because those that wind ore could actually be very bad for this. 
Let's stick to normal arrows. Get shot. Oh yeah, there's a stagger. Oh, headshot. This is so darn fun. I'm loving this fight. Whee! I don't know why. I, I feel like that's actually fun sometimes. Just when you get screamed at midair and you will go flying because of it. Probably because there's no pain behind it. It's just, hey, you're going to go flying. Okay. Nope, get away. Ooh, wire bug. Hold on. Yoink. A wire bug for Mike the Purple. Ow! Dodge. Like a boss. Like a professional dodger. I was trying to dodge that time. My dodge didn't want to function with me. Okay. Uh, uh. Sometimes professional dodger. <laughs> Power boost. This is gonna hurt. Ooh, and level two char level two dragon pierce. I'm hoping to break another part. Wait, it's toes? Was it it's toes? You mean to tell me it was like it's like paws or like little feetsies? Was it his elbow? I don't know what part is his elbow. I think I have an idea. Yep, it was his legs. Got it. It's his legs. Like, it's his lower leg, I think. I'm don't run from me! Okay, you run from me then. I got three wire bugs. I'm just gonna fly up. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, wait. I got... Three sub I got two other sub camps here. Excuse me. I'm back. Back. Yeet. Smack. Oh, and there goes the noggin. Don't take this person off. Right in the tail. <laughs> Don't take this personal as I shoot an arrow right through your entire- right down the entire entirety of your abdomen. Oh my, that almost just landed. Is his head a better weakness now because it's broken? Probably not. He's nearly dead. Yeah, that's a- how- that's a charged wind shot, I'm gonna call it. Charged wind beam. Back here. I just shot it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure me accidentally shooting like five arrows into that little baggie didn't really matter compared to when freaking Kushala just shot a giant air beam at him. Meow. Nope. Nope. I love that also the power. Oh, there goes the black, the black wind, the black smoke. Seriously though, what does the smoke, like the dark smoke do? Does it, I, I'm curious, is it dragon element infused? Because that'd be cool. Or does it mean, oh, do not get hit by this, no, by, <laughs> no matter what, or else you're going to be like suffering for it. Refresh my attack boost real quick. I don't use power coding often, so, ow. Put the bow away, put the bow away, put the bow away. Hit, hit, no, nope, not the potion. The mega potion. Okay, that, that wind attack. Yeah, let's just use power coins. Refresh. Okay, I thought he was doing the big whirlwind. I almost just got destroyed. Get the evil wind out of here. I'm gonna call that evil wind. I probably won't, but it's evil to me. Nope. Get dodged. I'm just gonna come around right quick and put some arrows in your face. I'm doing basically nothing. 
I only got hit once with that dragon element, or twice, during this entire fight. Oh my god, I was wondering what that sound was. It was just, okay, still fine shot. Okay, let's stop using the power coatings because, nope, don't re-equip them. I'd rather have some so I can automatically re uh, restock and not have to get more. Don't want to use them all. Oh, he's getting lit up. Tail, 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 exploit tail. I did this a lot when fighting Camellio, so I just lit his tail up. There he goes. And it's only been 32 minutes, and with the other parts of the recording, it should only be... It's probably gonna end up being around 40 minutes at most. Yeet. Oh wait, I have a Palamute. Go Sandstone. Oh wait, hold on. I know some people- I- I know if- I know it's a whole dust of life and all, but I work with these- I've been playing with my buddies a lot, so... Oh gosh! Ow! Oh, I saw that coming! Ow! Oh. You got that going, man. Oh, I thought his wind door was done. Like, he wasn't using it, so... Okay, yeah, no. I work with my buddies all the time, so I feel like it's a- I cancelled out his ultimate! Cool. I play with my buddies all the time, so I feel like it's only fair to give them their, um... Give, use a Dust of Life to heal them up. I d I'm just trying to be nice. I don't really have any other explanation, it just feels nice. Are we gonna kill Kushala for the first time with Evil Incarnate? I think we might. Let's do it! <laughs> I didn't expect him to be one shot! Hey, thanks, buddy! Hold on. See ya! <laughs> oh, that was funny. I, I thought it was gonna take like maybe two hits, maybe three, not. Listen, I usually don't expect the Wyvern Mount rides to kill the enemy, but it's always funny when it's Day or Gem first try. Let's go. So it, it was funny just to see that happen. Just first hit. That is amazing. Are we still recording? Yep. That is nice. Hold on. Watch out, dog. You can't be standing right here. Um... Oh wait, no, um, crap, we can't get it because the, pa Palamute kept getting in front of the camera and I was trying to also get a photo of his face for the uh, Hunter's Notes. <sighs> Kushala Deora, done. That was awesome. Ooh, two tails. I'm assuming they, I, I, I don't, I'm not going to assume, but I think they might give me the tail because, um, Bo ain't the greatest at cutting off tails. So, let's see what he has. Uh, Mike, good to see you've made it back safe and sound. The threat posed by Kushala Deora has been quelled thanks to you, and things should quiet it quiet down in the Frost Islands now. You're becoming such a splendid hunter. It does my age hard good to watch you grow so. But, the path of a hunter does not end. It is a constant journey. Look forward to seeing where yours takes you, Joho. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. That was awesome. So, uh, let me go check that out. I'm gonna check out that armor. Ah. Normal and rap. This actually might play well into the bow. Gain the power. Water and ice get an increase. Water and ice again also allows recovery to exceed the red portion. Okay, this is a very good bow. Recovery speed, agitator, diversion, which is nice for some builds. Handicraft, which is good for sharpness. Piercing, oh my gosh. This is a very good armor for bow. And it still looks cool. I still actually like the look of this. That's actually such a good thing for bow. Because mine's mostly just dodging and recovering stamina. So getting in a bit of normal and rapid, or like Kushala's blessings, would actually be amazing. Oh wait, um, he should have a Kushala bow now, right? Kushala. Okay, so it was. Oh, it was an ice tree. 
Ice steel bow. Oh my gosh, it is actually. Hold on. <laughs> I, I'm gonna be making that bow later. <laughs> I need that bow. Oh wait, and the palco stuff. Let me check the palco stuff. Uh, I'm assuming it looks the same. Yep. It's the same as my Kushala. Not my Kushala, my Camellios. Okay, using I, I'm assuming that's taking inspiration from Anubis. It looks great. But I prefer my magic boy. So that armor does look great. I want I want magic. So um yeah, I will end the video here because I want to be able to grind some more, get some bows ready, and improve my bow build for the next video. And also I feel like I feel like that Kushala might play very well into a bow build for damage so yeah thank you all so much for watching i hope you all enjoy thank you all so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed and i'll see you all in the next video later later